Once you sign up for Pipe Dream, you can create a new workflow using this plus button here on the very top left. I'm going to select the cron scheduler trigger for this workflow to run my code on a schedule. I can select a cron expression or run my workflow on a simple schedule every hour, minute, etc. I'm going to run this every hour and then I'm going to add a new step to run Node.js code. I'm just going to run a simple console.log statement here and I'll show you how that shows up when we actually run our workflow. I'll also search for select actions and I'm going to choose one to send a message to a channel, okay, chat.post message. This requires authorization with a Slack app. So I'm going to connect my account and authorize PipeDream to send messages to my test workspace. I've got a test channel here, and I'm just going to send another hello world message. When I click deploy, this cuts a new version of my workflow, and then all new executions of the workflow run on a new version. I can hit run now, to run the cron job manually. And then I'll see any standard output produced by step show up below the step. And then here, I notice some debugging information for the Slack message, but let's just confirm that Slack message did indeed get sent 